artists' workshops are being edged out all over Berlin. The season of summer festival is always a joy. With this new administration, street art will continue to thrive. And we all work together to create this magic. People choose to visit, live and work in places that delight or engage them. Their experience of place is their cultural DNA, what makes the place authentic or distinctive. But how do we successfully embed culture in development? Where do we begin? With so many different stakeholders involved, it can be a daunting task. This is why we co-led the creation of the Urban Art Forums, including culture and development a step-by-step -step guide to help developers identify, agree and deliver the right cultural opportunity for a site. But who exactly sits at the table, when these decisions are made, and what do they contribute? Usually, someone from the local authority who provides connections to the local plan. A developer who informs the master planning of the site. People from the local community who are experts on the area's needs and history. Someone from the creative industries who informs dynamic spaces to work and trade in. An artist or institution, they give insights into the needs of their sector. The investor who informs financial and social targets for success. A design professional who creates a cohesive and exciting design. A communications professional who creates a distinctive narrative. And a cultural professional, curator for example, who identifies the shared opportunity and delivers meaningful translation between all the stakeholders. We identified that all parties need a process, one that transparently begins with the needs for clear measures of success that prove the value proposition. The process allows all parties to work together to their strengths and ends with an exciting challenge for the creative brief, with all of the resources and needs identified at the outset. Our publication provides a six-step guide that is backed up by multiple case studies to ease the process. Step one, agree a vision of success. First, identify desired impacts and characteristics of the development to create a clear vision of success. Step two, establish benchmarks and measurements. Introduce a way to evaluate success early on to build a business case help meet policy requirements and optimize the development's impact. Step three, select the cultural engagement. Agree what type of engagement experience the development should create. For example, a permanent sculpture or a festival. Step four, build an inventory of resources. Next, understand the financial budget and human resources available. Step five, create the strategic opportunity and engage a cultural professional. Combine the information gathered in the steps one to four to create a strategic opportunity. This will help to select the right cultural professional for the project. Step six, agree the cultural brief. Lastly, work with the cultural professional to complete the cultural brief before identifying the right match of cultural opportunity and artist. Embedding culture will impact resiliency socially, environmentally and financially. It can help embed newly built areas into the wider network of a city, improve the dialogue between stakeholders, and can financially benefit local creative industries.